Welcome back to Arsenal News TV and today we're going to first look at Aaron Ramsey issuing Arsenal ultimatum after Everton make approach for Juventus star and then we're going to look at Arsene Wenger explaining why he's trying to sign Real Madrid striker Karim Benzema for Arsenal. So the first transfer headline states that Aaron Ramsey issues Arsenal ultimatum after Everton make approach for Juventus star. So the reports are stating that the former Arsenal midfielder could be set to leave Juventus this summer. Former Arsenal midfielder Aaron Ramsey is reportedly only set to consider a return to the Emirates should he depart to Juventus this summer. He has previously been linked with the move away with Everton, having already reportedly made an offer. The Welshman only departed North London in 2019 for a switch to Turin. He has found opportunities hard to come by though in Italy, with reports now suggesting that he is open to leaving the club. There are further suggestions that Juventus are willing to let him go and are find, working to find a solution that is satisfactory for both the club and the player. Everton have already thought to be interested in making a move and have already sent an offer to Ramsey. Meanwhile, Premier League rivals Crystal Palace have also been linked in the past. Any departure this summer would signal an end to Ramsey's two-year spell with the old lady. He originally joined the Italian Giants on a free transfer in 2019 after his contract with Arsenal expired. Winning the Serie A title in his first season at the club, he has made just 65 appearances in all competitions and scored just 6 goals. Despite reportedly angling for a move away, reports from Bianco Nero suggest that Ramsey would only consider a move back to Arsenal this summer. The now 30-year-old certainly starred for the Gunners during his spell in North London. Signed from Cardiff City in 2008, he went on to make 371 appearances for the club, scoring 65 goals. The Welshman was also on target for the Gunners in two FA Cup finals as they lifted the trophy against Hull City in 2014 before doing the same versus Chelsea in 2017. His 11-year association with the club was brought to an end with his move to Juventus. Upon pinning his deal with the Italian Giants, Aaron Ramsey admitted that it was a tough decision to choose to leave Arsenal. In a statement issued on Instagram, he wrote, I wanted to issue a personal statement for all the Arsenal fans who have been extremely loyal and supportive. You welcomed me as a teenager and have been there for me through all the highs and lows I've encountered during my time at the club. It is with a heavy heart that I leave after 11 incredible years in North London. I will continue to give the team 100% and hope to finish the season strongly before heading on to my next chapter in Turin. So it looks like Aaron Ramsey has issued an Arsenal ultimatum of the Everton make approach for Juventus star. And it looks like the former Arsenal midfielder could be set to leave Juventus this summer and it looks like he will only consider a return to the Emirates if he leaves Juventus this summer. And with the Gunners looking for a Martin Erdegaard alternative, Aaron Ramsey may be someone that they bring back to the Emirates and someone that could return to the Gunners, with him saying that he will only come back to the Emirates. So you have to wait and see how this transfer move plans out. So this nicely takes us on to the second piece of news, which states that Austin Wenger explains why he tried to sign Real Madrid striker Karim Benzema for Arsenal. So the reports are stating that Arsene Wenger has explained why he trying to sign Real Madrid striker Karim Benzema while in charge of Arsenal. French forward Benzema was heavily linked with a move to the Gunners towards the end of Wenger's 22-year reign in North London. Benzema was facing competition from Gonzalo Higuain at the Bernabeu, but he lasted the Argentine hero, subsequently establishing himself as one of Real Madrid's greatest ever players. The 33-year-old has scored 277 goals for Real Madrid and won four Champions Leagues and three La Liga titles well in the Spanish capital. Wenger heaped praise on Benzema ahead of Real Madrid's Champions League semi-final clash against Chelsea on Wednesday evening and was asked whether he tried to sign him for Arsenal. The legendary manager told Bean Sports, Yes, because he was in competition with Higuain for a while. It was Higuain for three games, three games for Benzema. He played the game based on passing and connections, so he was an ideal player up front. He's a striker who makes people around him better, and sometimes he has strikers who scores goals, but they make players around them worse. He's not one of them. If you put Benzema in the team, I would want to play with him. 
working at Arsenal from 1996 to 2018, Wenger is the club's longest serving and most successful manager under the Frenchman, also won three Premier League titles and seven FA Cup. So it looks like Arsene Wenger has explained why he tried to sign Real Madrid striker Karim Benzema for Arsenal. And he has stated a lot of good things regarding Karim Benzema, but he was unable to show it in the game versus Chelsea. But we can clearly see that he had that one opportunity versus Monzi where he turned the goalkeeper, the defender, he, had, he used the defender as a wall and to bend it around the defender, but Monzi made a brilliant save. But Karim Benzema is a striker I would love to have at the Gunners, even though we have two elite strikers in the form of Pierre-Emerick Aubameyang and Alexandre Lacazette. But if we signed Karim Benzema at that time when Arsene Wenger was manager, when we got rid of Giroud and we are looking for a new replacement, at that time if Benzema joined, I think the club would have had a decent striker. But we made the move for two other strikers instead, such as Alexandre Lacazette and Pierre-Emerick Aubameyang. But Benzema would have been someone that could have joined Arsenal. We've always been linked with him back in the days. From 2014 to 2018, in Wenger time, we were always linked with Karim Benzema. But it looks like Karim Benzema is never going to sign for the Gunners at all. But we did try to sign him and this has been confirmed by Arsene Wenger. Where he has stated that this guy is a player that can make things happen. He can make other players look much better. And you can clearly see that when certain strikers play, they have to have the ball to score like you have certain strikers that need 100 chances to score but when it comes to Karim Benzema he's someone that scores in one in two chances or one in three chances or one in four chances so he's someone that has the ability and he knows how to link up play it is a shame that Arsenal couldn't sign him but I still think we have adequate replacements in the form of Alexandre Lacazette and Pierre-Emerick Aubameyang hopefully they are sensational in today's match versus Villarreal because if these players don't score goals we ain't going to go to the final and I'm already nervous but other than that guys, remain blessed, stay tuned for the next video, and peace.